So the new year is around the corner and it is probably time for most of us to set goals for the entire year. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the New Year's Resolutions Hub. It's a Notion template that consists of different exercises, pre-built databases and cool automations that will turn your goals into something that is habitual, something that you're striving towards every day. Personally, I've been creating annual goals around this time since I was 14 years old, but I didn't always stick to them and in fact, about 9 to 12% of people stick to their New Year's resolution plans. That is because first, we need to make sure that we have a great vision that we feel really connected to. Then we need to turn that vision from something vague and abstract into something actionable, meaning today, this week, this month, this quarter. And then finally, we're going to turn those new things, those new initiatives, the things you've never done before into a habit. And this is where the third part of the template comes in. Let's take a closer look. One of my absolute favorites every single year is actually doing a reflection on the year that has just passed. And here we have a template with a Spotify a little playlist to keep the inspiration going. Then we have divided this document into different sections of your life. For example, the experiences that you've had, the people you've met and people you've connected with yourself, the things that made you happy, things that made you sad accomplishments, the things professionally and on the personal front. Then we have learnings, areas of improvement. And obviously, as you can see, every one of those sections has different prompts that you can reflect on. So let's open up a toggle. For example, what did I learn this year? You can say no code automations. Try to do something a little bit more specific. It's always best to get as specific as possible. It's a free flow. Just get in the mood, get maybe an hour or so for yourself to just flip through pictures, flip their memories and put it here inside Notion. So once we've done the reflection, a lot of ideas are going to flow out. And then it's time for us to take a look at our life as a whole. And it starts with the grand purpose, why you're here on earth. It's a super complicated topic and this is why I have attached a resource that says finding purpose in five minutes. There are a few frameworks that you can use just to come a little bit closer to it. It's a lifelong quest for most people to figure out what it is, but there are a few little and quick hints that you can get in order to just get moving. If you skip purpose and vision, then it's very unlikely that you're going to create meaningful goals and that you're going to actually stick to them. So we start with the lifelong purpose and then we're going to be going a little bit more specific and a little bit shorter time frame. So here we have high hard goals. There's an article about what those are. And finally, we have this part, which is the goals for 2023. I'm a massive fan of the OKR model. So you have your objectives and you have your key results. And here we have a few examples. So here we have get into the best shape of my life, something that is your intention, it's your objective, but it can be measured in many different ways. And most importantly, it can be turned into many different projects. Projects are a little bit more finite, something that you can execute this week, this month, and in a shorter time frame. For example, if we want to get into the best shape of our lives, we might want to run a marathon. That's a project you need to prepare for the marathon, you need to schedule a certain number of runs, create a routine, that type of thing. We can finish a specific obstacle race, we can gain a certain amount of muscle mass. Every goal has projects attached to them, so you can actually break those down into something that is propelling you towards one direction. So even if one project slips through the cracks, you still know your intention and you still have very specific ideas on what you can do today in order to get back on track. So let's go back to the main view and I'm going to show you a couple more things here. So this is the kind of like bigger picture manifestation of your life vision. But then again, we need to turn things into very concrete goals. And this is why here we have our goals. This is something that we've already seen. We have different projects. There we have our projects. So every project is related to a bigger objective, a bigger goal. Here we have our projects database, and then there's a timeline view so you can see how everything relates to each other. And this is a really convenient way to look at all of the projects that you have going on at one point of time. And the third major component of this template is powerful automations that will remind you and help you build the habits so that you can stay on track with your goals. In this section, we also have a couple databases. For example, we have the reflections and journaling. There are different types of reflections and journaling that you can do. So if you feel like reflecting maybe daily or weekly, or there are different types of reflections that we have access to. In fact, if you click on the new card, you have your weekly reflections, five minute journal, morning journaling, night journaling, 
things of that nature. So just click on one of the templates and you're going to have prompts, very easy questions to answer and everything is going to be really nicely documented in here. Finally, we have a habit tracker by Red Gregory. You can check out uh, the video, the automations. It's a really neat way for you to put all of the things that you want to start doing. For example, let's click on this plus icon. So every day you can just go ahead and say, hey, I've just worked out, I meditated, and you can just very easily adjust the name of the goals over here so that you can keep track of them right there. And then you will have this progress bar over here. And most importantly, just as you go through this, you will be able to see the overall progress for every habit and see where it stands in your month and overall in your year. Here are some cool automations that you should have absolutely check out. For example, this one is going to send you an SMS reminder with a link to a Notion page that says, hey, it's time for you to do your morning routine. Very sweet. This Notion template is going to be a fantastic starting point for you to kick off 2023 on a high note. You can grab a link to download it for free in the description below and keep us posted about how the year is going. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's, and good luck crushing your 2023 goals. Cheers.